Hi everyone, my name is Matthijs de Jonge. I'm the game director on Horizon Forbidden West. Last year we revealed our ambitious new project and since then the team has continued to make great progress on the development of the game. We are very excited and honored to give you an update in this state of play. And in the countdown video leading up to this moment, you have already seen glimpses of the Forbidden West, but now we have something truly special for you. Almost 14 minutes of gameplay captured on PlayStation 5 and you don't have to wait any longer. Let's get right to it. Easy, no. easy. It's okay. You're safe now. Wait, what happened? Where's Erend? Ambush. Ruins are crawling with raiders. They hit our camp hard. We ran and they chased us down. Erend was away from camp. Scouting. I bet he's still out there. What was that? Raiders got machines on their side. Claw striders. You should go after Aaron. If they find him before you do, who knows what they'll do to him. No, I... You're injured. I have to... Uh, don't worry about me. I'll make my own way out. Get going. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> What are raiders doing in these ruins? I hope Aaron is okay. There might be more. Yep, another one. I need to get clear. That was close. Maybe I can lose him in here. These guys won't give up.
Damn machines. Better go under. strong here. I have friends, okay? I'm not just the ones you slaughtered. But when they come looking for me, there's gonna be trouble. Raiders said they were heading for the old bridge. Maybe I can cut them off. Better get to higher ground and find a way. the bridge. I think I know a way to get there fast.
Help's on the way, Errant. Another one. Come on. <clears throat> but this time, I have a present for you. <clears throat> I found it, Emily. Huh? What you sent me for? Right before the Raiders got me. You did good. Now, let's see where this thing will take us. That a storm was coming. Yeah. And it's almost here. So there you have it. The first gameplay footage from Horizon Forbidden West running on PlayStation 5. We hope you are as excited about it as we are. While we have you here, we would like to spotlight some of the new elements you have just seen in our gameplay capture. And to help with that, please welcome Ben McCaw, Narrative Director on Horizon Forbidden West. Thanks, Matthijs, and hello to all our viewers. Horizon Forbidden West is set a thousand years in Earth's future after a global catastrophe. People live on in primitive tribes, but they're no longer the dominant species. Giant, animal-like machines now roam the land, and they are extremely dangerous. The machines aren't the only threat in the Forbidden West. A strange red blight is spreading across the land, and it won't be long before it strangles all life. 
Aloy, our hero, is the only one who can stop the blight. But to do that, she and her companions will have to comb through the ruins of the old world to find the technology they need. In this quest, Aloy has sent her loyal friend Erend into the remains of San Francisco to find a crucial piece of technology. Erend encounters raiders from a rebel faction of the Tanakh tribe. They are vicious fighters, but even worse, they've acquired the power to override machines. To rescue Erend, Aloy winds up fighting them. But first, she must cross the ruins to reach their camp. We face a lot of obstacles as we traverse the ruins of San Francisco. To overcome them, we've given Aloy some great new tools. Using the focus scanner, you can highlight spots that allow free climbing anywhere in the open world. The pull caster speeds up climbing and can get you quickly out of trouble. The shield wing allows you to safely descend from great heights or surprise enemies from above. With the diving mask, you can stay submerged as long as you like and take your time to plan a path around amphibious machines or boost through strong underwater currents. And to speed up overland travel, a variety of machines can be overridden and used as mounts or in combat. Combat in Horizon Forbidden West puts a strong emphasis on tactics and player choice. For close range combat, the spear is an excellent option. There's a range of combos that have different uses and effects. Valor Surges add a unique set of special abilities, one of which can be used to knock back nearby enemies. The spear can be charged to create a high damage effect that can take down even the stronger enemies. A wide array of different weapons is quickly accessible via the weapon wheel. A slingshot with adhesive grenades to temporarily stall machines. Bows with arrows that can strip armor and expose weak spots. A powerful launcher that fires spikes that explode on impact. Smoke bombs that temporarily blind enemies. Or you can pick up weapons shot off from machines. The full game has many more unique weapons and each of them can be upgraded on a workbench. But more on that another time. The player will need to be smart and creative and use all of the combat options we have shown to deal with a large variety of deadly machines. Sun wings in the sky, claw striders and tremor tusks on land, step moss in the water, even the seemingly harmless burrowers that you saw briefly swim by. They are all dangerous and even more so when overridden by human rebels. We've only scratched the surface of the rebel threat as Aloy will fight them in many forms throughout the game. And to defeat them, she must explore the open world to uncover the secret behind their power, and how that secret is related to her quest to stop the blight. And this is just one of the mysteries she will unravel as her journey through the Forbidden West takes many twists and turns. It's time to wrap it up. We will have more updates closer to launch, and everyone here at Guerrilla can't wait for you to experience the full game. Thank you for watching.